Hey guys, welcome to the vlog. It's been a while, I know. We have my manager to thank for that because she keeps changing my damn schedule around, making it difficult for me to even make plans with my friends. Yeah, she's terrible. Don't like her. Anyways, we're gonna do a little Home Depot haul to start off with. I will get into why this, there's no movies on that shelf at all. I have this light off as usual just because the lighting sucks. That's, that's what I get for only having a yellow light bulb on hand at the time. Anyways, we're gonna start off with this. It is the um, like fixture thing. If you have outlets like this, then you understand. I'm not gonna wait. I'm not gonna explain it. You should know what it is because <laughs> I know what it is. Just, I'm tired. Bear with me, and I'm not in a good mood. My day literally just got ruined like five seconds before I started this vlog. So bear with me. Anyways, this is the kind that you can just stain to whatever color you want. Personally, I think I'm gonna leave it the way it is. I don't know why. I guess that's, I don't know, the color of this is just really pulling me in, so. That was the first thing that I got. Well, technically, that was on the second trip. We're not gonna, I'm not gonna explain it. So, stain-wise, we have two. This one is English Chestnut, which is darker than this one, and this one is the Golden Oak. This is the one that I'm using to stain the wood that's going to go on the wall. This I'm using because it's for this shelf right here. This one right here. Because that is just going to blend into the wall, I think. And it doesn't match the rest of the shelves that I have. And I have somewhat of an OCD problem when it comes to things matching when stuff. Um, I will get into why I'm doing wood instead of paint or wallpaper or wall tile. I will get into that in a whole other video because there's a, there, there's a lot of detail for that. <laughs> Anyways, um, another thing that I got was a new light bulb for this light because I want just straight up bright white lights. I don't want any yellow, which that's what I've got in there because that was the only light bulb I had on hand. Uh, another thing I got was this paintbrush. I do have a pack of other paintbrushes. There's like four or five of them. And I don't know where it is. Like, my room is clean. Aside from the things that I just still have to go through and organize. Because I, but everything that um, was under my bed, I took it out. I'll show you guys in a minute. But I've been packing up and moving stuff out of my room upstairs since we're finally getting this remodeling project up and running and I have not found them paintbrushes yet which is really weird because I thought I didn't put them anywhere but in a spot where like they wouldn't get like thrown out or anything and I don't know what happened to them I haven't seen them and my room is pretty much clean but I got this one for the paint because I need to finish painting these shelves, as you can tell. Same with the bookshelf, but that's going to be a whole other video for, like, later in the week. If I can force myself to do that, because that, that, that's over, I want to say that's close to, that's a little over 100 plus books right there, I want to say. But yeah, I got this for the paint when I do get that started, along with these and the thing to open the paint. Then I have this brush for the stains and because I've learned my lesson all right after I had gotten my tile done on my floor a few weeks later I did some white paint and I got some white paint smudged onto my floor and lucky for me like before it fully dried I managed to smudge it enough to get it off the floor however some of it is still on the floor but it's barely noticeable because it looks like the white marble that's in the black because the tile is black it's black marble but like there's white in it you understand but i've learned my lesson and this time i do not want straight up black paint on my floor so i have two drop cloths for that 
and I think that's that's pretty much it aside from um just not I'm just knocking everything over today aside from this box right here I did get like five other boxes but I've packed up a lot of stuff and have just put it someplace else for now so yeah and DVDs they are all out of the room as well. I do have this one part of the shelf to fix. Um, the only DVD that I still have is the Avatar, The Last Airbender. And then I've got my box that I usually keep my cat in, which I'm referring to this one. You can't really tell, but that's usually where that is. Um, that's pretty much it for the haul. Um kind of just going to walk you guys through what progress I've made for moving stuff out of my room at this point. Do you see what I mean? It's bright, but it's just yellow. I'm going to turn this one off, though, because that one you can directly see the light bulb. Okay, so um, starting with this, I did take down pretty much all of the perfume that was on this shelf. I only left three because... These are the two that I reach for the most, and this one, I don't know, right, right there, there we go. This one is something that I've just been reaching for nowadays as well. So I only left out three op, Jesus, three options. Now I'm kind of just, I'm going to turn the camera around so that I can just make this easier to show you guys as I'm talking. Also, before we do that, I finally got it switched out to a stud. And so far, no allergic reactions, so I'm really happy about that, because the other one had multiple different types of metal in it, and it was just make, it was just really irritating my nose, so, fun. Anyways, let's, um, let's get into the mini tour progress, whatever the hell you want to call it. Alright, so like I said, this is the only box that I have, and my camera is blurry. Nope, that didn't do anything. Nope. Okay, so all of the clothes that are right here, aside from that package, that is, um, that we're not going to talk about. But, everything that is right there has been moved from the pink organizer right there. I do still have stuff on top and in the top drawer that has to get moved into a box. But for the time being, most of my clothes are just, well, most of the clothes, which are just like pants, are on top of the dresser. And then I only have like clothes in the first three drawers. But when that gets out of my room, those clothes are just going to be in that box. And that is where I will just be dragging clothes from. Those socks are all have they're all missing one so they're just sitting in a pile separated from those so ignore that um like i said i still have to paint that but yeah i did take out some cds as you can tell i only left my taylor swift and avril lavigne ones i currently have one sitting right there um all of this all of the makeup right that in the vanity has to go into a box but i'm not gonna put it upstairs because the upstairs can get extremely hot like if it is 75 degrees outside then upstairs it's gonna feel like it's 95 degrees or something so all this makeup is going to get packed into a box but it's going to just go in the closet for now and also these are the only two tripods that i have because this one is missing a piece on like the very bottom so it now just sits on like unleveled like it's like tilted to one side so those are the only two that i have i am just gonna replace the other one all of the bins that i had under my bed are out of my room um this already like i took out the mini fridge that i had my hands cramping um so the top of this is basically cleared off aside from these two photos. Well, this is a diamond painting, which it's just a, yeah, you know what it is. It's a diamond painting of Chucky because I love horror movies and that franchise is one of the best of all time. I mean, there are movies 
in the franchise that I don't think should have just been created, but that's just my opinion alone, but I like it. My neighbor's the best, so yeah. And then I just have, like, a Christmas or birthday present that Vanessa put together for me. But I did get some makeup packed away in these top two drawers. I have the rest of that to do. Um, I did take down some photos that I had on this thing along with my magnets. Um, I don't know if I'm going to keep this or if I'm just going to move that over here, which was the original plan, because the TV is going to go over here. But I do have to take down these things from senior year because <laughs> while it's been nice knowing you, you're not staying there anymore. Uh, the blinds I do need to get fixed. I'm just going to replace them with something completely new. Something that Twix cannot break because he likes to break pretty much anything that I buy. Honestly. But, yeah. This is my outfit, by the way. The cardigan obviously doesn't really match, but I put that on because the fan is on in the kitchen and it is freezing. Whereas in my room, it's not that cold. Just because I turned off mine. Anyways, that's pretty much it for, like, the room update, I guess you want to call it. I did take some bags down, as you can tell right there. Um, and I've managed to get as many clothes to fit in my closet as I can, because it's just, like, weighing that down and starting to bend it. But, yeah. And that is a tripping hazard so i did shove some shoes in here whereas i did pack more because i did have them sitting under the vanity but yeah guys also let me show you guys what i got today okay i had to go get cat food and something else i can't remember what it was but if you remember i showed you guys a few of these prints in my um room remodel haul video or whatever where it's these prints and the store actually the store in my hometown actually had them but they only have th they only had three left and I was like I'm just gonna buy all three like I know that's not what I came here for like I specifically went in there for envelopes but I came out with these and then when I was in a different store getting cat food I found these, I found two of these really cute jars, and they were only $3 each, and I was like, well, I need one for, I need to get something, oops, I need, I was like thinking, well, I need something for the cotton balls to put in, and then I saw that they only had two, and I was like, one for cotton balls, one for cotton rounds, like, plus they were really cheap and super cute. I wasn't going to pass that up. I just hope Twix does not break those because if he breaks anything else, I'm going to just be upset all the time, probably. So, yeah. I don't, I can't remember if there was anything else that I wanted to talk about. Um, I don't think there was anything else. I think that's it. Anyways, that's going to end the vlog for today. Um, I am going to vlog tomorrow. By the time you see this... By the time you see the vlog that I'm doing tomorrow, this will be up. But, yeah. That's pretty much it for this vlog, you guys. Be sure to subscribe, like, comment, turn on notifications, all that fun stuff. And, uh, yeah. I will see you guys tomorrow, which is Wednesday. I don't know why. I just looked at my wrist. I'm not wearing a watch.